Hello, and welcome back to Poem with Purpose. This is Dr. Diana here, and I am here to talk about the next podcast episode. Let's talk through stopping breastfeeding before you are ready. It is so important given the landscape on what we're dealing with. It is so pushed down our throats to to just stop breastfeeding. Just give formula. It's it's too hard. Um, You're feeding your baby from your body. So of course it's not going to be easy. So let me introduce you to, I want to introduce myself to you. This is Dr. Diana here. I'm the CEO and founder of Pump With Purpose. We are a global lactation and postpartum private practice, teaching women all across the world to breast pump through personalized care to help you to increase your milk supply with the right pump, flange, products, and schedule, and to change the world one pumping family at a time. I'm a doctor of public administration, a certified lactation counselor, a certified breastfeeding specialist, as well as a certified postpartum doula. I am, you can find me on all social media platforms, but my main one is Instagram. You can find my website at www.pumpwithpurpose.com. So we are a big fan that, yes, we believe that your mental health matters. If, you know, breastfeeding is not for you, then we completely understand. But we know the importance of the other concerns that can take place if you stop breastfeeding before you're ready. If people are pressuring you or not being supportive or just saying, well, I don't really want to help you. So just stop or you know, every excuse in the book. It's, it's important to know what your goals are and to work with someone that can help you to reach them. And even when against all odds, even if you are a single parent, even if you are a primary parent, even if you work full time, even if you're home and have multiple children, there's so many things that are stacked against us when we are having children. And it is important to get and arm yourself with the village. It is important to let your support system know what is important to you so then you can make changes or you can make requests or you can ask for support and you shouldn't feel bad for doing so. You want to feed your baby from your body on your own terms in your own way. And you want to make sure the people around you, as well as your support system, as well as your care team, know that that is important to you from, from the OBGYN, midwife or home birth doula, wherever you're delivering, hospital, birth center, wherever, all the way till you are ready to be done with that part of your postpartum breastfeeding journey, whether you are nursing or pumping, they both have its place. Um, And it's important that the people around you know how important it is for you to get that kind of help. So just saying to stop Breastfeeding is not what you need to hear at that moment. You need a plan. You need a schedule. You need a routine. And maybe it's not just the stop. Maybe no one tells you about the guilt or the regret that can come when you stop breastfeeding too early. Sometimes you one may think that just stopping is important and that's going to be the answer, but sometimes other concerns may be created. Um, you may need some more support at home. You may need support to come in the home. You may need a real pumping plan that works for you. And when you are told to just give formula for others who don't completely understand what goes into that, um, what it's just not easy to just do it. And also you, your body just doesn't always just like snap its fingers and weans just because you say, I'm just going to stop. Before you even consider um, weaning down and stopping, make sure you've given your child formula. Make sure your child is adequately on a formula. Make sure that there are no concerns, reflux, um, other concerns, allergies, or anything. You have your child on a formula. If you're going to do so, um, start introducing it early before you actually start. Because some people, they start um, to say they want to be done, and then they haven't checked the formula because they have a freezer stash and all the things. And I'm like, if I find you before you do so, I'm going to tell you to introduce it sooner prolong the the breast milk that's in the freezer, but also introduce the formula sooner. So you know if there are concerns because so many people stop and then they come back to me and they're like, I need to relactate. It's not working. We've tried five, 10, 10 different formulas and nothing is working. That's because you want to check all that stuff and have a plan if it is not right for you. I've helped people to stop it because they know it's not right for them, but I made sure and I make sure that they have a plan um, that's available to make sure that they are able to still feed their baby um, because that is important, um, but also that they have the support and, and make sure they're sure and have considered all options as well. Um, and if you need help on your breastfeeding journey, if it's just not as easy um, as some people on social or other places may make it seem you find a close friend or family member, you see people and they just make it look so easy. 
and it does not come easy to you. It does not come natural to you. Please know that that is normal. Please, I don't even like the word normal, but please know that that is okay. How about that? Please know that that is okay. Please know that I want to be here. I want to help support you. I want to make sure that you are reaching your goals, especially when it comes to a pump. Because if you are putting a pump to your nips, we want to be a part of your journey. We want to help you to increase your milk supply, maintain and sustain your milk supply with the right pump, flange, products, and schedule. And our premier pumping consults can help you to do so. We offer different lengths. Um, so find us on social. Instagram is our number one platform. Um, you could DM us over there. Um, go to our website. We have a contact us form. We have a chat, whatever. Let's chat. <laughs> um, whatever it is that you need. We have an email address. So many ways to get into contact with us. Whatever is easiest for you. We check our platforms to make sure that we can um, be there when you need us. So this is Dr. Diana here. We are talking about... <sighs> Don't just stop breastfeeding before you're ready. Get the care that you deserve. Make sure you have a plan and then go from there. You can find us on all social media platforms. Instagram is our largest, Pump With Purpose. And you can find us on our website, www.pumpwithpurpose.com. Until next time with Pump With Purpose.